Hello, and good day to you. It is Talking Really. Today's story sort of follows on from a video I did recently about uh, people reporting other people for alleged benefit fraud. And this story comes into that category. It's um, a story in, in the mirror. Disabled couple benefits have been stopped after the DWP were sent a video of them putting the bins out. Hello and welcome. This is uh, the Mirror. The DWP were sent a video of the couple who are Tracy and Darren and uh, they were filmed putting the bins out. They obviously have had their benefits stopped in the in lieu of the investigation that will be coming up. We've been left by the DWP for the last um, eight, ten weeks with no form of spend or income. We both get taken our own separate rights and I am my husband's carer and I get a support carer. But because there's been an issue with this, um, through no fault of our own as far as we see it, um, we've had no, all our benefits have been suspended. Okay. The only way we've managed is I've had to rely on my mum, who's a pensioner, she's 77. Uh, she's been after the golf set really. Uh, my daughter um, is out of that, even though she doesn't have any of her own. Um, and one of my friends has been loaning money, but the more we borrow, the more we have to pay back. The only benefit that we have actually had, which has been a golf send, is our housing benefit. There's no way, otherwise, we'd never be able to do this all our money. We'd be in a tent somewhere. So I'm not sure what they expect us to. To, um, go through, but for Christmas, I don't know. I just don't know. Okay, so the story uh, goes they're now under in investigation and in the fraud department. Uh, they've been had their payments frozen after a mystery person sent the DWP videos of them putting their bins out in Plymouth. The couple said that they spent years claiming PIP for serious health con complications that affect everyday mobility and have not encountered any major problems. The government department is now investigating their situation to determine if they are more capable than they've made out. DWP officials said that they would not comment and further pending any potential legal action, but confirmed the couple no longer have an active PIP claim. Shock Tracy says that she and her husband Darren are legitimate disabled benefit claimants and DWP already knew that they only require the use of their sticks some of the time. They have a video of me walking from my front door to put out the rubbish in the bin and use that as evidence because I didn't use my walking stick. Their response was, you claim Pip, your money is supposed to pay for someone to do that for you. Since then I have barely left the house. I won't go out the front door because I'm so afraid thinking that someone is watching. I'm normally an outgoing person. Before I'd say, let's go down the road and go for a coffee and a bag of chips somewhere. But now, it's just too nerve-wracking. The fact that we've been penalised for putting out the rubbish in the bins without our steps is ridiculous. It's awful. Tracy says that she'd also been pulled up on the fact that she walked with a shopping trolley without her stick. When people have a shopping trolley with them, how can they use a walking stick as well, she said. If it's cold and damp, like it is now, I use my stick more to go out. But we don't really go out and about as much. We may go from the front door down the drive and go for a ride in the car, but we don't go walking anywhere. 
Their lives have been made worse by the fact that their employment, support and care allowance have also been taken away. Tracy says that she has no idea if their payments will ever return. Our issues are still the same. In the meantime, we still have mobility issues and we're still both diabetic and I am still in pain. My husband has spina bifida occulta and chronic liver disease. And she said it's been an ordeal trying to find any spare cash to pay bills and negotiate extra time to settle direct debits. The last straw was today, Friday, December the 6th, when I was told to ring again for an update in the next couple of weeks. I don't know how we're going to manage. We have direct debits, the water bill, things like that. So here's a story that we, we were trying to highlight the other day with the, the other video. The fact is that people are jealous and envious and malicious. It's just malicious, really. But the GWP, I think, have gone overboard with this story when, when really they should have investigated. And maybe they have. Maybe they've just um, taken the uh, video at face value and decided that they will just remove everything and uh, reinstate later. No, so it's like uh, you're guilty until proven innocent. Okay, thanks for watching, and uh, we do need some likes and shares. And of course, if you're a new viewer, thank you for coming and. Uh, don't forget you can click the subscribe button to help us out and make sure that we are a growing channel and that's it i'll catch you again bye for now